Hey guys, uh, I kind of had a little experiment I wanted to do here and I'll explain to you uh, the reason why or at least the concept of what I'm thinking here. But So I have a Baofeng uh, GT3 which is basically a ham radio, 2 meter and uh, 70 centimeter. And then I have a uh, older uh, Cobra GS, GMRS FRS radio, a little handheld radio. And uh, yeah, the, my originally just originally it came as like a like a walkie-talkie two-pack, and my other one broke. But you know they they transmit on a frequency that can be picked up by the Beofeng, and also my uh, SDR Sharp here. And I've kind of been experimenting with it, and it definitely works. And I'll show you how it goes. And yeah, I guess the reason that, or the concept was I wanted to actually give my wife a radio that wasn't complicated. I wanted something that's small that she could put in her purse and it was very light. And the issue with the Beofeng is this thing is very intimidating. Not for me it's not, but for her, you know, she doesn't know, she's not very really technical, you know, I'm an IT guy, so like this looks very really inter intimidating to her, that all the different numbers on the on the freaking panel, so yeah, I mean that stresses her out. So I wanted something simple that she could just basically turn on and you know, right now I'm on channel 9, which is FMRS, because I, I, I guess you need a license, I guess, to transmit on GSMRS, or it's called a GMRS. So, obviously, I'm not going to incriminate myself in a video here. So, I mean, if the shit hit the fan, would you really care? You know, if you, I mean, they don't really monitor that license anyways. Um, I don't know if they even collect fees for it anymore. I was, I was reading some stuff last night, but. So, for this video, I'm going to use FMRS, because I'm just right down the street, but. You know, maybe later on I'll do some testing, you know, to see if uh, what the kind of range I have here. But because I do actually have a big antenna on my roof, and I'm hoping I can pick up a few miles away because, you know, she she doesn't work very far away, and she's usually like around town. So I'm thinking, if the shit hits the fan, you know, she can just take this thing out of her purse and fire it up, and then, you know, I can because I, I keep a radio on every single one of my cars. Um, so either I'd be in the in the in the car. Or, you know, I'd be at my house and I'd be running the base station, you know, and I have generators in case uh, there's no power, so I could at least run my computer and, uh, you know, hook that up, you know, to my, my overhead uh, disco and antenna. And, uh, yeah, I know I can definitely pick it up. I just don't know the range yet. I haven't tested it yet. You know, I know FMRS doesn't have the same kind of range as, as GMS, GMRS does, though. So, yeah, I'll just show you a quick demo and, uh, Got it working, but that's pretty cool. You know, I mean, I, I can take this cheap little radio, and I can transmit and receive with uh, this Beofeng or, you know, one of these ham things here. So, uh, yeah, I just, I mean, it's great that it's less complicated. I mean, really, it's a literally just, you know, going up and hitting the buttons, you know, uh, you know, or, or channel up and channel down. Yeah, here we turn the light on here. So, channel up, channel down. That's it. So there's actually, uh, I think it's one through eight is a GMS slash FRS channel. And then uh, I think like 22 through, I don't know, 22 through like 17, I guess, is the other GMS RS band. But all right, let me uh, do a quick demo. I'm going to get back on the computer and uh, on my screen here and uh, get it going. All right, guys, back here, and uh, what you see in front of you is SDR Sharp, and this is connected to my disco antenna over the uh, over the roof. And then I have my uh, little Cobra. I think it's it's called a MicroTalk, but I can't. It doesn't say the model number on the front of it, but okay. So um, what I thought was interesting also was that um, the the frequency. Here's here's the manual for this thing, and the frequency. This this one right here. I'm on channel nine, and what's funny is it, it's close to that frequency. It's like when I transmit, maybe it transmits on a different frequency. But um, what's weird though is like it it transmits on it transmits on a different frequency. At least the way SDR picks it up differently. SDR sharp picks it up on a different frequency. So, all right, let's let's give this thing a shot here. So there we go. I'm going to turn this thing on. You're not going to be able to hear it, but you can see it. And I'm going to do a quick transmit. And you can see. Boom, boom, boom. All right. All right. And I'm 
do a call. There's, there's like a little calling feature button on this phone. So I'm going to hit that call button. And you can see that transmitting. Yeah, maybe some other guys can help me, some of the ham expert people, dudes, because uh, I can't... Uh, I can't figure out why. Like I'm on four six seven five six six, but the uh, manual shows that it's on a different different frequency. It's pretty close to it, four six seven five eight seven five. So it's definitely pretty close. So I, I, that's interesting that it transmits on a different frequency. Uh, like I said, I'm still learning this ham radio stuff. So um, I'm hoping to take the license here in a couple months. But yeah, I'm just kind of playing with this as I go and. Uh, yeah, this thing's pretty cool. I get weather alerts, too, with this thing. Um, okay, so next experiment, it's going to be turning on the... Um... All right, so now we have the... Um, Baofeng, and here's the uh, GMSR radio. I'm going to hit the call button. So, yeah, I don't know if you can see that, but basically it transmits. I picked it up on basically the Bayo thing. And I can transmit. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> I don't know. All right, well, I'm just having fun, just playing around. But yeah, I think that's cool. So I can give my wife this super light little tiny radio. Um, and hopefully I get some range out of it, you know, in the GS, G, GS, I don't know if I can pronounce that, GMRS. So yeah, they say it's like 36 miles in like open territory, which is freaking ridiculous. I highly doubt it. Um, but yeah, cool. Low cost radio and you can communicate with these Bayo things. But yeah, way less intimidating for her. So cool. All right. Let me know if I have any questions.